Hi. So, I'm back. If you don't know who I am, I'm Evelyn. Um, I'm not dead. Broke the news to you, I'm not dead. I just went on a little hiatus for my pilots. <clears throat> yeah. And by hiatus, I mean absolutely no creativity whatsoever and have and basically lost all interest in doing YouTube videos. So that's what I mean by hiatus. Turn this off. Um, well, I started doing it again because I've honestly been having a lot more ideas lately. And also one of my friends, he watched a bunch of my YouTube videos and was like telling me how I should make more, I should continue doing it, and I was like, are you sure about that? And he was like, yes, you should do it, I, you should really do it. And I was like, okay, so here we go. I look absolutely disgusting right now because I just got out of the shower and also I'm about to do my makeup. So, I'm doing, that, doing this video, I'm doing this video for like updates and crap and like, um, just also just to show you how much I've evolved in my makeup. Spoiler, a lot. I now know how to do my eyebrows correctly. And I can do a lot of things now correctly, surprisingly, for once in my life. Okay. Um, so for, so right now, I'm... So I'm also going to go tell you what I'm using through this video, like a proper beauty guru. So right now, I'm... I've been I've been into Cardi B for a long time now. Like ever since I heard Bodak Yellow, I was like, okay, this girl fire. Right now, I have I have not heard like his like her whole album, Invasion of Privacy. I've not heard her whole album. So right now I'm listening to it. I'm on I Do. So far the only songs I've heard besides these few songs have been Bodak Yellow, Be Careful, and I Like It. Those are the only songs I've heard from her. But, but but now I've heard I do drip and something that involves the number twenty. I forgot what it's called. But these songs are like all fire, and I'm like, how how did I not ever listen to this album? Like this thing is fire. How? So I'm I whenever whenever I get out of the shower and I do my makeup, my face is always really dry. So I recently got this spray, and a bunch of people know what this is. It's I got I got some Ulta, and it is Mario Badescu. That, and it is a skincare facial spray with aloe, cucumber, and green tea, and it's very good for your skin. So I always spray this on after I get out of the shower, or I'm just feeling really dry. So. It also smells really good, but it does not taste good. Okay, now I'm gonna let this dry. And while I let this dry, I will tell you what primer I use. And I'm thinking about switching it. I don't know yet though. I use Professional by Benefit. And this is really good, but I wanna explore more makeup. This is the only primer I've ever used, like, in my entire life. I've only ever used this. So I want to, like, explore more in my makeup. So this is, this is almost empty anyways. I have to, like, force stuff to come out. So, yeah. So I use that. Oh, I my light, my mirror just went brighter. That's cool. And then I've recently started using a different concealer. Okay, now, I do not use foundation. I used to use foundation, but it kind of really messed up my skin so I kind of quit on the, on the whole foundation thing um so I now only use concealer around my eyebrows so I used to use one by covergirl I believe but now I use um this one that my mom got in a makeup bag yeah I'll put the products in the, in the description below and I'm just gonna go ahead and get my, my eyebrow stuff ready because that's what I usually do first, my eyebrows. Why is there a tack in here? I don't know why there's a tack in my brush thing. And then my beauty blenders are over here. I have three of them, well, actually four. 
One is for my face that I don't really use anymore. <laughs> that rhymed. <laughs> and I have two other small ones, but I mostly... Yeah. Oh, God. I mostly use this one. So... This is about dry now. It's tacky now. My lips taste weird. That's gross. So, I'm going to put this on. I'm disgusting and I use my hands and I don't wash them before. I, te I technically already did. I, I took a shower. Okay. So, as you may notice that I am in a different room. I'm also in a, I'm also in a completely different place. I no longer live in Washington, I no longer live in Georgia anymore. I now live in the beautiful state of Washington State. Um, I was, fun fact, I was originally born here, but then we moved to Georgia when I was six. So, cause my dad's in the military. So we got stationed in Georgia and we lived in Georgia for almost nine years. I'm now 15. And yeah, I'm not gonna share the school that I go to since I don't have that many people that watch me, but I'm still not gonna risk it. So, uh, I'll, I might do a room tour later in the year. I don't know yet though. I'm now gonna, I'm now gonna do my eyebrows and I might, I'm, I'm gonna do them. I'm gonna do them separately because I might do a video on like just how I do my eyebrows. So I will be right back, and I'll be right back. And during that time, I will be listening to Cardi B. So if you see me dancing really weird, then you know why. Okie dokie, I am back. I have my eyebrows done. They're beautiful. Okay, now for the part that I have no creativity in lately. I have no clue what eyeshadow I'm gonna, going to do. Great. Um, I usually like look on Pinterest for like eyeshadow looks. Okay, well, I'm going to go on Pinterest and look at eyeshadow ideas and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've decided that I might do like a light pink and orange look. Maybe. Mm. I might use the hot pink from NYX, this NYX Ultimate palette. Uh, the one right here. Might use that one. I said light, so like a light pink maybe. No. Mm. I don't know. And the orange from this palette. I don't know what this is. Something cosmetics. I think it's like a Lumiere. A Lumiere cosmetics, I think I think that's what it is. I don't know. But the colors are very pretty. And I might use that orange. called Coco Taxi. Yeah. I can see those being kind of cute. Maybe. Let's see how this turns out then. Maybe. Or I can use another light pink from, from another palette. I don't know what, what other palette has a light pink in it. The only one I think of is this one. And it's Winky Lux Kitten Palette. Nope. Well, mm, well, no, it's too light. Yeah. I was gonna go for this one, but that's just too light. So, nah. Uh, there's a pink in this one, but it's like an insanely bright pink. It's called Element of Surprise. That's an insanely bright pink. I'm not using that one. I can use... This one's Boxy Charm Pure. 
I mean, there's pinks in it, but it's like a shimmery pink and then like a really dark violet. See? Yeah, they're just like, they're like these two. I'm not doing anything too intense today because I'm gonna go skating with a friend today and I don't wanna get all sweaty and gross. And all my, all my makeup like runs at my face and no, I don't want that. That's really, uh, that's really unattractive. For my base color, I'm gonna use Perfect. <laughs> oh, I dropped the palette. It should be fine, it doesn't fall that far. Okay, it's fine, it's good. We're, we're, we're fine, we're good. As I was saying, we are going to use Perfect from this palette. And that's my base color, just to set my eyes. So, and I don't have any Morphe brushes unlike James Charles, so I don't have any numbers to tell you. So, I literally just like use like the most random brushes for about everything. I, I, I literally use like a blending brush for literally everything except for this one. But I have like five blending brushes and I use them for like everything just because they're so also very helpful and I love all of them. So, except for one. Yeah, the one, the one I don't like is this one. It's too big and it makes everything look horrible. So I don't use that one. The one uh, that's my all time favorite is an e.l.f. blending brush. And yeah, so it's called an e.l.f. blending brush and this one's like my all time favorite. So. She's never disappointed me. I'm thinking about like putting the orange like all like all in my crease. Or maybe like all maybe like all over my eyelid. Yeah, all, all over my all over my eyelid and then in the crease I'm putting Nike. There you go. If any boys are watching this, you didn't understand a word I just said, which is which is okay. But why would any boys be watching this? I've like what? I don't know. All the all the colors from this palette are extremely pigmented, and I absolutely love it. This one's actually not a blending brush. I actually have no idea what this one is for. Most but most brushes I have, I don't know what they're for. I don't know what they're meant to be used for. Did you just hear my cat snore in the background? You can't even see him. There he is. Hi. Hi. That's Manson, by the way. Love him. I love him. Hey, watch the claws. I don't want you to ruin my bedding. Those are fitted sheets. The Louis Vuitton sheets. No, I'm kidding. They're not. I'm not rich. I literally have three dollars in my wallet right now, like as we speak. And I'm gonna spend them all tonight. <laughs> I've been watching like a bunch of like new beauty gurus. Like I've been watching um. My favorite one right now is Antonio Garcia. The problem is, is that I don't really know if they're a boy or a girl. I'm guessing boy. So I will put his YouTube channel in, in the description below. So you could go check out his hilarious videos since he is very relatable. So yeah, by the way, if He's actually a girl, and I'm, I've been calling him a guy this entire time. I'm actually probably going to feel really bad. <laughs> and then another one, Haley Morales. I've been watching her a lot lately, and she is so pretty. Oh my god. I'll put hers in the, in the description below, too. But her, like, even her without makeup, she's so pretty. Like, what the heck? And her makeup's, like, really good. And she's, like, 15 or 14. I don't know how old she is, though. She looks like she's like 18 maybe. But I'm guessing she's probably, she's probably she's probably like 16 at least. I don't know. But now I'm taking a brush that has no product on it and blending the top out. I've been getting into like new music lately and lately I have been absolutely in love with Billie Eilish. Oh my god. I've been absolutely in love with her. Like, if I was a lesbian and I met her, like, bro. Bro. I would date her so fast.
so this is cause like one, she is absolutely hilarious. Two, her style is very unique and honestly I'm I'm kinda living for it. But also she's like absolutely gorgeous. She says she's ugly, but everyone's like Billy, where? So I've been in love with her lately. And oh, by the way, I have not said anything about this. I have never been to a concert, but my first ever concert is going to be in two days, and it's Panic at the Disco, and I'm so excited. There's there's definitely going to be a vlog on that. You can trust me on that. I'm seeing Panic at the Disco live, and I'm so excited. Oh my god! And then on November sixteenth, I'm going to see Twenty One Pilots. I'm so excited, bro. Like you have no idea how excited I am. Holy crap. Like literally I get to see Brendan Yuri in real life in like literally two days. In two days. Literally two days. Bro. That's like absolutely insane. Like Oh god. Now I'm gonna go in with Nike. put it in my crease but oh my god also speaking of Tom and pilots let's talk about the comeback let's talk about this okay so jumpsuit jumpsuit Possibly, like, the best song ever created in the history of, like, any other song in the entire world, so. And then Nico and the Niners. Okay. I loved Jumpsuit right when I heard it. Like, right when I heard it, I was like, boy, this is amazing. I actually kind of hate this shade. This is too light. <laughs> okay. Well, not using you. Switching. I'm going to go with Tropico. Right here. But, um... Yeah, like, right when I heard Jumpsuit, I was in love. Like, oh my god, I was in love. Oh, uh, that's better. That's way better. But then when I heard Nico and the Niners, it took me a little bit to actually love, actually start to, like, love the song. Like, when I first heard the song, I was like, oh, mm, it's okay. But now that I've listened to it, like, more, like, more, it's actually bomb. Like, it's so good. And then actually today, um, God, what is it called? Uh, Levitate. Levitate came out. I actually, um, heard the leaked version, like, last night. And this morning, I, w I, was on, I went on Facebook, and there was an article about Levitate coming out, and I almost crapped myself. And honestly, it's like, it's like Nico and the Niners. I don't like it right now. I don't like it that much right now. But I know that when I listen to it more and more, I'm going to start loving it. So, I'm not going to say that this song is horrible yet. But, we'll see. And also, about, about, about Panic of the Disco. In my opinion, I don't like all the songs on the new album, Pray for the Wicked. Like, the only song I don't like is, um... This is like, uh, something about dancing. Something about that. Has dancing in the title. I hate that song. I, I don't, I, I don't like that song. Like, one of my favorite songs from the album is called The Overpass, and they're not playing that at the concert, and I'm like, what the heck? How could you not play The Overpass? Like, that's such a good song. Like, why? 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 But besides The Overpass, I also really like, um, I almost said Don't Throw don't Me With A Good Time. That's not from this album, Evelyn. That's from Definitely Bachelor. Um. Hey, look, Ma, I made it. That song. I like that song. Music video. The music, the music video is good. I'm just like, why did they use a puppet? Like, 
why. Oh well. To be honest, Brendan probably thought of it while he was high, to be honest. Probably just like high in his studio. It's like, I want to make a music video with me as a puppet. That's probably how it all went down. To be honest. I'm gonna do my inner corners too. I like so, I like so much to talk about. Oh my god. Okay, who has been watching Shane Dawson's series with Jeffree Star? Cuz uh, I have. And I've been a huge fan of both of them for a long time. Like I've started getting getting into makeup because of because of Jeffree Star. So yeah. I love Jeffree like bro. I love him so much. I love Shane equally. Like I love both of them so much. And this series that they're doing together is like such a good idea because Jeffrey's life has been such a has has been such a mystery and like everybody has been so extremely curious on like how is Jeffrey so rich like how is he the way he is now and that's all being unraveled in this series and it's awesome like obviously it's Jeffrey's life and he has the choice to expose himself or not he has that choice but just everyone has always just been so, like, curious about, like, what he does in his spare time and, like, how all the makeup gets shipped out. I'm very happy they're doing this because I've been very curious myself, too. So it's going to answer a lot of questions that everyone has been having. Yeah, it's pretty cute. I actually kind of like that a lot. Okay. I actually kind of, I actually kind of like this look. It came out completely different to what I imagined, but I'm actually kind of loving it. So now I'm gonna spray my face because my face is getting a bit dry. So also, this kind of mixes as like a setting spray too. <laughs> you just that kind of is like a setting spray too. Well, it, it actually is. It's a setting spray as well. It's a setting spray also. You know, can somebody please make a compilation of like, like, Evelyn stuttering five minutes straight? <laughs> it's like, do a video like that, please. I would love, I would love to see some something like that. That'd be like absolutely hilarious, like, bro. Now I'm gonna do the most crucial part, and the most difficult part, which is liquid eyeliner. I always have to take like a deep breath before I do this, so. And pray. Because <laughs> lately, lately my wings have been coming out wonky as crap. And it's been extremely aggravating me. I use um, NYX Matte Liquid Liner. So, this is awesome. The brush looks like that. Beauty Guru. That's the brush. It's like thin crap. Yeah. So. Pray for me. Okay, has to fill it in, but it's actually better than how it's been. Cool. A bit thicker than how I usually do it, but eh, it's alright. It's Gucci. Now, usually my other eye is like the easiest one, so just watch how easy this one is.
you know, just by seeing it, they're definitely distant cousins. <laughs> yeah, definitely not the same. But it's okay. Sure. Um, well, actually, there's a part, that's a part, that's, there's a part that's really annoying me. It's like a gap in it, and it's like... There we go. Fixed it. There was a gap in it. It was like really annoying me. You know. It also gets on my eyelashes when I do this. And then when it hardens, it makes putting on mascara really difficult. So I'm just taking my eyelashes and just rubbing them. I was gonna say something, but I forgot what I was gonna say. You, you're not doing makeup right if you don't make an ugly face. Now, mascara. I use two different mascaras for my eyes. On my top eyelashes, I use Better Than Sex by Too Faced. And then on my bottom of lashes, I use... I always have to say this one slowly, or I stutter a lot. Benefit Roller Lash. Yeah, on my bottom eyelashes because I don't like when bottom eyelashes look chunky and gross. And this one does not do that. This one does that. So I use this one on my top eyelashes and then I'm going to curl them. So I do not use fake eyelashes either. God, I can really go for some McDonald's right now, bro. Like, oh my god. Like a Big Mac. Sign me up. I had McDonald's for the first time in like four years, like a few months ago. It was great. I forgot what I had. Oh, that, that's, that's what I was going to talk about. I'm officially a high schooler now. I'm in high school. I'm out of that horrible place that we call middle school. Thank God. Finally, about time. Still going to the same school because the school I go to is. I was gonna say that, but then I'll really give it away what school I go to. So, not gonna say that. But it's a school that has sixth grade all the way to twelfth grade in it. So I'm I'm staying in the same school. So, not much is gonna be different, but it's still gonna be cool since I'm finally out of. Middle school. I am now a freshman. Thank God. My par my prayers have been answered. I also don't like how like the look of like chunky mascara looks. I hate that look. It's like if your eyelashes look like legit spiders, I'm like, honey, you should probably rethink your makeup. Like some girls at the school I used to go to, I'm like some girls literally have like spiders for eyelashes. This is making me clinically depressed. There is eyeliner on my lid. You can't see it, but kind of. That is making me clinically depressed. Great. I'm going to use the savior of the day, which is concealer. And cover that boy up. And then go over it with eyeshadow. Oh, that made it like 10 times better. Bro, I'm literally a lifesaver. I have Be Careful by Cardi B stuck in my head. I hope you get what you're dying for. Be careful me. Do you know what you're doing? You're feeling such you're hurting and bruising. You don't, you don't get the whole world, but is it with the girl that you lose and be careful me? Now, my favorite thing. Highlighter. Okay, now over the summer, I have shattered two highlighters and it has made me depressed. For example, my favorite one, which is gold, and I shattered it and fixed it by Ofra. I shattered it, but then I fixed it. Crumbs still fall out sometimes, like some right there. But you know what? It's okay, because she's still gorgeous, and she still works the same exact way. So, 
I'm gonna use this beauty. And it is called Rodeo Drive. I believe that's what that, that's what that says. So now I'm gonna use my setting spray by NYX. It is the dewy finish. And I'm gonna put this on my cheeks. Oh crap. I forgot I have to, I have to be gentle with this. Cause like the powder will literally go everywhere. I forgot I had to be gentle with it. Boy. Oh, can you see can you see this? Can you see this? Bro. But to the concerts, sadly, I didn't get any VIP, so I'm not going to meet them, sadly, but that's okay. My mom tried to get VIP to Panic at the Disco, but we, we didn't have the money, so. Highlight the eyebrow. And do you see this? Do you see this? Do you see this? Oh God. Ooh, I I've also, I've lost 10 pounds and didn't even realize it. So now I'm really skinny and I am loving it I've been wearing crop tops lately just because my body has been looking real good so yeah and also people in Georgia have already started school I don't start school till September so yeah yeah I would say that I am done I'm gonna go pick an outfit and I'll be right back. Okay, so I am back. Um, I need to set my makeup with this. So, one second. Okay. What the heck is my dad doing? Your palette. So, I still wear glasses. They're right here. I might get contacts later this month. Maybe. Possibly. I don't know. Oh, also, I didn't say anything. I am going to be in marching band this year, and I'm so excited. Yeah. Um, yay. I still play flute. I've, I'm trying to find a way to do other instruments because playing the flute is boring kind of so I might either do percussion or trombone I don't know yet though I will show you my, my outfit in a second so these are high-waisted shorts these are some high-waisted shorts I got, got them, I got them from Hot Topic there's like rips on there's like rips right here. And then this crop top that I got at like Goodwill, I think, a while ago. But it's from Forever 21. It says on the tag. But this crop top, it's cute. Yeah. So now I can get a full look at my makeup. Here you go. No, I do not wear lipstick. I've been trying different different kinds of lipstick. I can only wear lipstick in the house. I can't wear it like when we go out somewhere. So I can't wear it today. But this is the look. Yeah. So hope you enjoyed all the updates and me do my makeup and I forgot to take a before thumbnail. Crap. Anyways, whatever, here you go. 
So, my, my, hair, my hair is purple, by the way. Yeah. So, I hope you enjoyed this. Follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. If, maybe not, maybe not Snapchat, actually. Sure, why not? Snapchat. Follow me on Instagram and Snapchat. Those are the two social medias that I am mostly active on. So, yeah. I'm active on Facebook too, but I'm not going to give out my, my Facebook. But, yeah, hope you enjoyed this, and I will see you guys in my vlog on, on Friday. It might come out, like, Saturday or Sunday, but either one of those days. But, hope you guys enjoy this video. And, yeah. Bye!